Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm just going to be doing a bunch of island updates and telling you guys all the updates that I've made on my island, basically literally what I just said. So yeah, the first update that I did make, um, which isn't completely finished yet, is this area um, that I terraformed right in front of the campsite, which has an incline leading down to it. So since we don't have any villagers right now, um, it's a bit awkward but um we do have a few shops a few pop-up shops here that i decided to make we have a honey shop and we have a small little um what do you call this a cafe um which i think is really cute i might redo this sometime soon because it honestly doesn't look the best and um yeah i guess i might redo it soon but for now it looks really good and i'm going to add some more organic like pop-up shops with like plants and like crops and stuff like that it's like a farmer's market type of thing and the second thing is this pathway from like the bottom of the plaza area and it's leading to the beach which i'm planning to make a strawberry farm and a pumpkin farm something something around here and after that you will see my new entrance which i absolutely adore it has this super cute new path thing and it has a wheat field a little donation box a lot of flowers some log sticks if you can see them and then there's like different variations of trees and little pergola so if you go over here you can go over here and just sit down and chill um and there's little fences so that you can't get out um so you go back outside there's a storage shed which is actually really really convenient for when i'm like building stuff and then i also have this um I have this scooter which I think is really cute and adorable and I like kept it there. It reminds me of like Luca, like the Vespers from Luca. And then we also have this, um, oh, I don't think you guys saw my new flag. This is my new flag. I did not make this by myself but it is super cute and it definitely fits Eclair. I think it's adorable so I definitely saved that. And the next thing I have, I also have a little pathway over here to lead to the small marketplace so we have the next cranny and over here we have the able sisters with the DIY workbench for some reason and then we go over here and we have a path and a little deck with a chaffara and a pile of leaves near like the small log stump and it leads to the museum it's a very simple exterior of the museum but i mean keep in mind that this is my first island after all and honestly it doesn't look that bad as i expected it to leaves here which is a really good mood setter i guess because i just think that leaf is adorable he's one of my favorite npcs and if we go over here since you already visited this area this is actually my campsite which i will be renovating very soon i don't really like the picnic basket no sorry the picnic um uh blanket actually I do appreciate the rest of this area though, it's actually very cute and um, if you guys notice I also have my first ever stunt tree. A stunt tree is basically a not full grown tree and it will stay like that forever because it was like a plant, like, I, it was like a planting hack type of thing. And then we go over here to um, a very blank space, um, I really have nothing. But other than that, we can go down here on this incline, little pathway, and we have the um, the secret northern shore beach. Um, and it's basically very simple. I kind of wanted it to be inspired by Spiritfarer, so I added some mush lamps, but there was really nothing. And this is the dream team, um, you know, gyroids. Uh, <laughs> I don't really know what I was doing. And I actually cleaned up my house so there's not overflowing amounts of flowers on the top of it because if you didn't know there was like so many flowers and just a bunch of weeds but I kind of cleaned it up a little bit and it looks like much better now so there's just a bunch of blank space a bunch of crops just so much mess but if you go all the way over here you'll see that I actually have terraformed very slightly Lolly and Fang's house this is Lolly's house she's up here um, and she's just hanging out under the tree that I gave her. I, I don't know why she really likes that tree. And here's a lot of mess. Oh, here's Fang. He's outside his house. Yeah, this is just a lot of mess. There's just like a bunch of items I don't need, a bunch of flowers. And um, this is just a bunch of people's houses because I just leave these here because I haven't decided whether or not to. Oh, he's having a thinking, thinking bubble. With Bo. Oh, I want to make up so we can eat snacks together again. But what if Bo hates me now? 
beautiful. Can you deliver this present for me? I want to have my snack body back. Okay, I'll save snack time for you. Okay, so I don't know why, but yeah, I, I will deliver it today. So let's go ahead and find Bo because I don't know why they're fighting, but they were, and it's just really sad. Also, here's an update. We got Shari. She's a very cute monkey. You guys will see her later on, probably in the next Let's Play. And I will show you her. She's absolutely adorable. This is actually Bo's house right here. I don't know why Dizzy was literally just standing outside his house and asking me to kind of get something and like deliver something for him when he was literally right outside the house. So, oh, Bo's crafting today. So, hi, Bo. Check me out. I'm doing stuff. What are you doing? I'm making me an orange rug. One of the bugs in the full whispered the DOI instructions in my ear while I was sleeping last night. So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. Check it out. Plans for an orange rug. I can teach you if you want. Yeah, teach me. Leave it to me. I've got it all scribbled down right here. So just read this. Oh man, your pockets are too full of stuff. Come back later and set you up. Okay, um. Well, I don't actually want it. Actually, I'll just, ah, uh, wait, um. But I need to give you this though. Um. Oh, you're back for my top secret recipe, huh? Here you go. Do I ask for an orange rug? Don't lose it. Oh man, your pockets are too full of stuff. Come back later and put you up. Okay, hold on. <laughs> this is confusing. We have to go back outside and we have to drop like pumpkins or something. Also, um, you don't mind? Just a bunch of chatter. Um, my family is outside playing a game and. They're just having a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, they're just outside playing a game. Anyways, I'm gonna go inside and um, I'm gonna go and deliver the present and grab the orange rug recipe. So, hey! Yes. Alright. So now we need to talk to him. Delivery here. A delivery for me. Yes. Here is your delivery. Huh? It's a present from Dizzy? But why? Oh, because the other day. I wonder what it is. Let me see. <gasps> it's a Western shirt. No! Why would you give <laughs> Um, try it on man. Why would you give him a western shirt? This is horrifying. Um. Mm, I want to be polite. Oh, really? I should hurry and change then, huh? Quickly. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, Dizzy. I'm so sorry. I mean, just imagine after cheese stains and stuff, they clash so bad. <laughs> okay, I think I get where this is coming from. I have to go say I'm sorry too. It's a chill thing to do. Beautiful. Thanks for your help with the delivery. I think Dizzy and me are going to be able to make up. There you go. As a thank you, have a fast food uniform. Thank you. Okay, I hear they're super popular. I hope you dig them too. Salt Lake. Okay. Let's see what it is. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, we're keeping this. Thank you so much. I'll see you around. Okay, so he gave me a fast food uniform. I don't know why he did. He must think I work at McDonald's or something. But yeah, thank you so much. Um, basically, I have nothing really else to do. I kind of just wanted to show you guys my progress. Um, and uh, yeah, basically that's it. I also want to see if we got a message in a bottle today because i have not seen one of those on my own island for a long time i only got one of those in like what the heck a dialogue fragment okay i have not seen one of those in a long time anyways um i've only seen them in like happy home paradise so i actually will try to make some videos on that because i have not filmed any of my progress at happy home paradise i've already made like 23 homes something and i still haven't filmed any of it because i don't have a capture card yet really expensive here um and it's just kind of hard to get so yeah anyways other than that i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching the let's play with me anyways i'll see you all in the next one so goodbye